You're next. Oh, that's that's messed up. What's up, everyone? It's DV, and today we're going to be creating a cemetery or graveyard. I don't know the difference. What's the difference between a cemetery and graveyard? You know, it, this would be a good spot because we just made the dance floor. <laughs> Wait, does that mean my dance floor in here would be under a graveyard? Oh my gosh, is that kind of creepy? I don't think eh, it's not. It's not creepy, right? No, it's not creepy. It's not creepy at all. But before we begin, I just have to say I hope you're having an awesome day. I appreciate all your likes and all your subscribers. If you haven't subscribed yet, that'd be awesome if you did. Let's go ahead and get into this. So I actually have a couple of people that are going to be joining shortly from my vid crew and they're going to be helping out with some of this as well. So big shout out to my vid crew. I will give them individual shout outs once they arrive. And it's definitely a lot easier if you get some help from friends. If you're going to actually like try to replicate what I'm doing here, you're probably going to want some help on materials. Otherwise, it's going to take a little while. Um, the main, main reason, let me tell you, main reason is we are actually going to be using some dried grass and the dried grass will actually take a bit of time to make because you have have to make dried grass. Did you even know dried grass existed in the game? It's kind of hidden, but uh, you can actually smelt or dry, if you want to call it dry grass, using furnaces. So we've got a bunch of furnaces under this floor we're using to uh, pretty much dry grass, and we're going to be using that for our graveyard. So I highly recommend using that along with maybe some gravel, some brick, uh, I would say brick stairs would be good too. But um, let me just clear this dance floor because if you didn't see my dance floor video um, yesterday, then you should probably check that out because it is a pretty cool video and it was a lot of fun to make. So the other thing we're going to do is we're going to use the furniture bench over here. And recently with this latest update, if you didn't watch my furniture update video, I've linked that as well for your convenience, but check this out. So see this uh, double street lamp. Actually, I'm going to make a lot of these because these are awesome. These are so cool looking. And we're going to make a bunch of these for our fencing. It's going to look cool. You probably saw that in my video. Oh, I also need some pebbles. I need more pebbles. I'm going to need a lot of these. Where's my pebbles? There they are. We need lots of pebbles. There's Buzz. Buzz is awesome. All right. So it is nighttime. So it's going to be a little dark while we do this, but that's okay. Um, what we're going to do is we're pretty much going to keep this flat up here. So you come up here, right? And we're going to make a like a little pathway. I wish there was like, um, like a smoke generator that we could use to make the ground foggy. That'd be cool. All right. So Buzz is making some dried grass because it does take a while. So thank you, Buzz, for your help on this. So we're going to go ahead and build all this out to get at least the range created. And then we'll go from there. So since I don't have a lot of dried grass, I'm going to go ahead and kind of expand out with this as the perimeter and use regular grass at first to at least set the boundary because if you start with the dried grass, you're going to get frustrated that you keep running out. But it's not going to be a huge cemetery. We're looking at something that's maybe about, I would say like something like that sized. We're going to have to put a hill, so we're going to block this out as well. We don't want to see this eyesore when we're on our cemetery. I feel like we're near a factory. All right, that's pretty good. That covers that up nicely. So you pretty much don't see that anymore. <laughs> it looks cool. We'll put a tree on that later. So I'm going to go and start working on the fencing, though. Let's see. Where's my lamp? There's my lamps. I only have 40 of them. Let's put them on the outside. Dude, that's going to look so cool. Already looks really neat. Let's make a bunch more. So official gamers here to help as well, which is awesome. So he's going to help fill in some of this grass. All right, so one thing I want to show you that you need to be careful about when you're working working with this stuff is anytime you put a block on top of dried grass, check this out. Look what happens. It turns into grass. So you got to be careful because, you know, after drying it, it basically resets into normal grass again. So be careful. And, uh, but the nice thing is if you put this on top, it's okay. But if you put a conveyor, then it turns it also, like if I put a conveyor down, this happens. Not so good. So I'm going to use industrial chest for plotting out our graves. So we got one right there. And basically I'm going to put like probably two away from each one. There's going to be a walkway here. Looks like we're going to need to bring these in just a bit. All right, so we're going to make these symmetrical space wise. So this is going to be our walkway, like I said. And so we're going to come through here straight into kind of like a crypt thing that's going to be in the center. So I'm going to space this two again. And I'm only using this for um, a guide. So these chests are not going to stay. All right, for these corners, I'm going to use um, bricks. So it's going to look like this. It's already coming together. I like this. So using our industrial chest again, we're going to kind of plot out what the building is going to be like. So I'm just going to space it out a little bit. And then what we're going to do is take a plow. I know, horrible, right? And basically do this. And then we're going to take our bricks right here. And we're going to basically do something like this. So that kind of works. Um, maybe some flowers, something like that. And so we're going to use mossy at first, but we're going to actually take out, we don't, I don't like just like having mossy the entire time. It doesn't look very good. So we're going to make it so that it's, it's just kind of breaks up a little bit as well. All right. That's looking pretty cool. And then I'm actually going to do some stairs. We're going to make an archway. All right. So we're going to go and continue this through like this. We're just going to go straight in 
towards the crypt. So the nice thing is if you actually pickaxe dried grass, it comes back as dried grass. But if you plow it and then unplow it, like, you know, plow it again, it turns into grass. Yeah, that's pretty cool. And then we're gonna work on something over here as well. Put torches, but that'd be kind of weird. All right, so we're gonna put some base, some bases right there. And then up top here, we're gonna put a little edge there. That works. And then over here, we're gonna do the same thing. So we need to get a little height and then same thing. And let's do the other side. We're gonna have to put some grass over here as well. All right, that looks good. All right, that's looking cool. Some of these are pretty big. Some of these are pretty big. That's looking pretty good. Okay, so, and some of these are actually gonna be wood. So how I'm gonna do this is I'm gonna break this up in a little bit. Um, in the meantime, I wanna actually also put some pathing around here. And because I don't have a lot of space, we're going to pretty much take this line out and we're gonna turn this into a passageway as well. This thing is going to be actually a building. Somewhere I messed up on measurements. All right, looks pretty cool. That looks pretty cool. Probably put another layer if I wanted to. All right, so we need to make our way down here. We're gonna use some bricks for these to just kind of block in the dirt areas. And let's put some ground here. And we're just gonna put like these fake shelves. So it'll be like this, something like that. Yeah, it looks pretty cool. And then on the other side here, we're gonna use black. If we run out of black, just do that. Just coal blocks. Oops, that's looking pretty cool. All right, let's put a back into this. Let's get rid of this dirt. Put some moss down. Looks pretty cool. I actually kind of like that. That look of kind of like some broken stuff too though. That looks kind of neat. Let's uh, put one right here. That looks pretty cool. Let's put some torches in here. Or actually candles might be cool. Like a candle right here. Maybe a torch here and there too. Actually, I like the candles better. Those look cool. I'll put a torch in the corner. And then let's put that black clay right here. This is way darker and we want that shadow look when you're coming up. You're like, what is that, you know? I thought about putting a door there. I just don't know. Let me see. What would an iron door look like right there? All right, so let's go ahead and replace a couple blocks with some mossy too. So we'll put a couple here and there. Something like that would be cool. And then I'm gonna finish this pathway because the pathway is too perfect. Oh, look at red firefly, got him. All right, so we also need some dead bushes in here. We can add those around. And we got to break this up a little bit so it's not all the same kind of mossy. It's a good idea to kind of like put these little bricks in the ground every now and then, like the stairs and the normal stone as well. So, cause right now it just looks, after a while, if you, you have too much of the same thing, it kind of looks like it's um, just way too fake looking. It looks plain. All right, so now I'm gonna go do some of these. Let's put some normals in. All right, so they put some signs out. Let's see what this is. I'm a rotten, ask for builds, you're next. Hold on, hold on, build me to work. <laughs> All right, let's get some pebbles in. <laughs> way, way. Dirty rotten, dupes, free smelter please. <laughs> Drop, don't know me. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna keep adding some detail here. Um, what I also wanna do here, so this ground, I wanna put a little bit of these um, bad dried bamboos. So we're gonna basically switch some of these blocks out with dried bamboo, and it just kind of breaks things up a little bit so it doesn't look so uh, flat. What's nice is it's a very similar color, so you can't really tell it looks kind of wood-like, but it's such a similar color from a distance while you're walking around that it just looks smooth. See how that looks from a distance? Dude, that looks so cool. Yeah, I think this looks perfect. I'm so proud of this. This looks red. So now what I want to do is I want to put like some trees around it. So we're going to add some, um, we're going to add some more grass and we're going to put some trees back here. So again, I, you know, I thought these lights would work out the way they did. They actually worked out really, really well. I think it looks really neat. I mean, you could probably even do something like this to, if you don't like the bottom parts of these, you can do something like that. Just kind of put a little brick border around the entire thing. It actually looks even better. Let's finish that. <laughs> I keep falling, dude. I keep falling, why? Ooh, mundane, that's a good idea, that's a good idea. My remains, <laughs> my remains. <laughs> okay, I gotta I gotta look through all these that they added. Hold on, I gotta add some light in here though. So we need a torch or something, maybe a candle. Let me go look for a lantern. These lanterns look pretty cool. So I'm gonna put um, one of these down here as well. I go with blue. That looks pretty cool. <laughs> I leaned over. Oh my gosh. Hold on. I got to check all these names out. Hold on. All right. So we're going to enter this and we're going to check out all the signs. No, no escape. <laughs> will he be back? Will I be, will he be back? Ricky D bones, Ricky D bones. Friend me. I'm a goner. My remains dug my grave. Oh, dupes. 
Surely you just <laughs> free smelter, please. DVD. <laughs> yes. I leaned over. Drop. She's working on another one. Don't know me. Officially dead. Yes. Do. Do. Instead of DV. Everyone calls me do. You're next. Oh, that's that's messed up. Build me to work. Ask for builds. I'm a rotten. Way. Way. Dude, these names are so great. Anyway, huge shout out to Buzz in game as well as the official gamer for their help on this awesome graveyard. I think it looks great. I think I'm actually really legitimately excited about this. Like, honestly, I didn't think it was going to come out this good. I honestly didn't think it was going to come out this good. I thought it was going to be cool, but I didn't know it was going to be this cool. But uh, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, hit that like button and lightly, gently click on the subscribe button if you haven't already. And I will see you all next time. Take it easy. Re. We should put one that says re. Where's re at? <laughs> re. Scammers.